We're going to go to flight route. We're going to make two types of mission. Actually, we're going to make the first mission for you. Since you're going to make a linear style mission, okay, yep. we'll make that first. On this page are all the missions we've already done. Okay, we test these out in our, our office in Milwaukee. So this is our side, our side of the front office. So we, we we've actually had drones you know that failed on takeoff. So we make sure that the one you've got actually works. We could delete those if we want. You can leave them on as examples. It's up to you. But all of your missions are going to be listed down on this page as you go. One of the benefits of this drone is you can create a mission today, fly it, come back. Two months later, fly the exact same mission, duplicate it 100% exactly the same way, time and time and time again. So if you're doing construction progress monitoring or site monitoring, vegetative growth monitoring, you can fly that same site reliantly and have data that's consistent across. There's that KMZ import. So if I make a, all I'm bringing in with the KML or KMZ is a line or a polyline or an area. That's it. I still have to set up all the rest of the mission parameters. So it's just as easy to make a mission on that side. We're going to hit create a route. These are the four types of missions we can make. For these two payloads, the only two you really need to concern yourself with are mapping and linear. Okay. Oblique is for making 3D models of objects, cell towers, things like that. Waypoint is to just basically go to this point, turn this way, turn the camera on for five seconds, move to the next point, face this way, do this, do this. So we're going to do a linear mission first, since that's the one you know. Yep. Familiar with? We're going to go linear. It's, it's, it's exactly linear? Curvilinear. Okay. I can have the line. Yeah. Actually, it's not curvilinear, it is it's polyline. It's got vertices, it's got okay. multiple vertices. It's basically what it's like. So if you wanted to do like a network of roads, it would still be linear? It'll have to be, you'll have to make basically make multiple missions. More, oh, for, for each. each leg, yeah. Oh, okay. Or if it's just a local grid, make an area mission instead. Okay. okay. Let's do an area, I'll do an area mission first and then we'll come back to the okay, mission. Sure. It's a little bit easier because the top, the, 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 the concepts are easier to travel. So I'm going to make a mapping mission instead. Oh my God, this is going to kill me. So again, when you're out in the field and this actually has satellite signal, this will zoom you right into where you're at. Okay, you don't have to go hunting. But we're going to have to go hunting, so it's pitch and zoom. So I'm in the map mode. I'm in a satellite view. So again, this little button here lets me choose between map and satellite. And the satellite is labeled, so as I move in here, Here, where are we flying in at? You can't type an address search in here, so I have to kind of point it out where I'm going. I thought it was down this way someplace, wasn't it? Well, Kenton, no, it's uh, 204. 